rises at that peak over there. And in the winter, it rises just This is a long way the from the starting blocks of A.D. Cropper's life. Upstate New York, beautiful. So I love the quiet, the songs of the trees as the wind blow through them. Cropper loves this view with perspective he didn't necessarily have as a young man. My path is not the traditional path. I didn't go, okay, I'm gonna get all straight A's and then I'm gonna apply for 400 colleges and I'm gonna get into one of them. No, my path was do what you really enjoy doing. Cropper grew up on the island of Trinidad to a Calingo Carib family. After kicking around New York City, competitive swimming challenged and channeled him. It has to be challenging, otherwise he gets bored because his mind works in like 20 different ways. I'm always trying to answer a question. I'm always trying to solve a problem. I'm always trying to gain intelligence or to gain knowledge about something. A.D. Cropper is a questioner, an inventor, and a teacher. He's taught like at a university and such as that. He's worked as an inventor. Um, if you look at your cell phone, some of the technologies in that cell phone today he helped develop. Uh, he's working on some new technologies for us right now. AD and I have worked together on a patent idea, so it's a, it's a very early uh, concept for product improvement. Over his career so far, Cropper's credited with four innovations, receiving U.S. patent protection. Section, turbulence. It's very important. Today, he's a subject matter expert engineering fellow at Raytheon Corporation. I'm very fortunate to convince him that this was the right place to continue his career. Noted industry expert, somebody that you just say his name to the customers and they know exactly, uh, uh, exudes immediate credibility. Cropper credits his discipline, values, and inquisitiveness across an integrated, holistic picture. I can kind of tell what kind of pushes him a little bit. Um, definitely family, um, unity, and knowing a little bit about, about his background. He comes from a community where the passing of knowledge is very important. What do you think he's most proud of? His daughter. I'm pretty sure of it. Dr. Cropper is passionate about his work and committed to being active in the community. Alongside with his many career achievements, he takes time to give back through research, teaching, participation in associations like ACES and IEEE, and serving the Native American community. I truly admire his ability to be a leader in so many areas. In manufacturing and in an OLED display and touch screen. Dr. Cropper came to Raytheon with a strong technical background, including inventions, patents, publications, and numerous technical achievements. He is a thought leader and industry expert in a complex technology area that is critical to the safety of our nation. His leadership and significant technical contributions accelerated the maturity of these key technologies at Raytheon. The family of ASUS is one of the things that I value most and the community and friendship that I've gained over the years there.